Hi lovers, welcome to my channel. My name is Made for Love and welcome to... <laughs> I could only call it a special reading because I don't think this is going to be repeated. Um, this is actually my second go at doing this reading. First of all, let me tell you why I'm doing this reading. For two weeks now, I don't know what's going on with this particular comic, but they've been haunting me. They want to talk. And of course, I've been resisting. Why would I give the comic a platform? I have nothing against them. Remember, I, I told you this about they trigger rapid soul growth in you and your person. So I have nothing against them. But at the same time, you know, a lot of them are, some of them are, qu are quite dark. And apparently the one that I tapped into was quite dark. I had such a massive headache that every time I came on this side to allow the comment to speak and to ask her questions and to make her statements, I would get a massive headache. And it was so debilitating that I couldn't even speak. So when I watched back the video, it was just like, it was pure shit. It was pure shit. I would never put that out there because I, I couldn't even interpret the cards. I couldn't get the words out. Like my, my, my words weren't coming out. I, cu I couldn't do it. My, and that's because the head, my head was just pounding, just pounding. It was just pounding. I did two, two sessions. By the second session, I kind of got a handle on things. So I'm going to publish that, but I'm doing over um, the first part. You'll see cards on the table already, and that's because I found it so interesting, <laughs> the cards that came out. Because I asked what mood um, was the karmic and the DF or the person that's watching this video coming into this conversation with. I found it re was really interesting. So I left these cards on the table. I'm going to pull fresh cards for their mood. But I want you to see what came out. So on the DF side, because DF is on this side. She does not give up her position for anyone, okay? She's on this side, and this is a karmic here. I, I'm sorry I'm channeling she, but this, it, it, I, I really have to, I can't concentrate. Uh, the headache is coming on already, right? So, uh, I, might, I, I might probably say she, you, you just have to excuse me today. I, I can't, I can't, I can't concentrate, all right? So, I found it was so interesting. The first card that came out for DF. She's like purposeless. She didn't see the purpose of this. What's the purpose of this? Why am I here? Why are we doing this? <laughs> and she was shocked that this comic would even reach out to her. Why the hell does she want to talk to her? What does she want to say? Is she obsessed? <laughs> this DF does not give. She does not give. She does not give. And she's just numb. She's just emotionless. She's just sitting there. All right, like whatever. We're here. Um, let's do this. On the comic side, this is a, um, her last, a last attempt. This is a desperate attempt now to regain control of the situation and really trying to exert her power and strength, right? Karmic is in victim mode. DF, you are the problem. You are the reason why things are falling apart, right? I'm really surprised that he would even take an interest in you. I mean, like, what does he see in you? I'm surprised that things have come to this point. They're just shocked, shocked and surprised. I'm going to pull a card. Just to confirm that message. What she shot what what's the comic surprise that? Guys, I'm really good with my program sometimes, but not today. That we're having this kind of conflict. She's surprised she's surprised at all the conflict that's coming up in the, um, um, the situation between her and the DM. Right, and she can't seem to get past it. And that's because she's codependent. Look at the card of codependency here. He su she's surprised that he will walk away. Anyway, so we're going to put these back in the deck and see if they come back out. Or if they're in different energy now that they've kind of, you know, had a moment to breathe. All right, so this is going to be part one. So we're here because the comic wants to talk. She want to talk to the, to the DF. I don't know what she want to talk to the DF about. But she want to talk to the DF. I'm saying she, but you know, it, it's not she. I'm sorry, guys. The comic wants to talk to the DF. All right, let's see what's going on here. All right, so as we enter this session, guys, you know how this goes. 
um, one party asks a question, the other one answers, and we have a little conversation going. Um, but we want to see what part, what um, each party, what energy they're bringing into this session, they're bringing into the council room today um, with Spirit. I'm a, I am your narrator. Spirit is the mediator here. I will give the final say. We have first... <laughs> Death is frustrated. She, she's coming back in with the same energy. She's saying helpless. Def does not appreciate that I, I dragged her into this. She is not appreciating that at all. Manipulative. <laughs> Haunted. Ashamed. Isolated. All right. So what is DF saying? DF is saying I'm absolutely frustrated by this exercise. Why am I even here? I feel like I have no say in this. Why am I here? I feel absolutely helpless. Why can't I just walk away from this? Why have you dragged me into this? She's just a manipulative <laughs> who is haunted by her own actions. She should be ashamed of herself. I've tried to keep myself out of this whole situation. Why are you dragging me into this? Def, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It won't happen again, okay? It's just a one-off thing, Def. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm dragging you into this. The karmic. What do they have to say? Def is not pleased at me or at this exercise. Karmic is saying secret service. What's this? Oh, okay. I get it. solution <laughs> the comic is solution oriented she's come to find a solution <laughs> people pleaser what's that about escape suspicious And last, what is she saying here? Sorry, I keep saying she. What's the comic saying here? What's the comic saying here? I have files on you. I've been watching you. I've been investigating you. I know what's up. I've had my suspicions for a long time now. And I recognize that he's trying to escape this connection with me right but i'm here because i'm looking for a solution i'm sure we are two big feminines we know how to work things out we can work things out um i know he's a people pleaser and he's just trying to please you. he's not really interested in you um it's all lost in his path you need to back off okay excuse me all right so the f is saying because Carmen dragged us here she can talk She can talk. Comic, what do you want to say? You dragged us here today. You have the pissed at me. What do you want to say right now? Oh, there's some cards turned over. Okay, I'm not going to take them. I'm um, sorry, guys. I have to um, reshuffle. But it looks like, you know, DM's not putting in the work in the, the connection anymore. And he's looking to express um, his love. And that's why the comic is here. All right, let's see. Let me make sure there are no other cards turn over. I have to do fresh shuffling. Sorry, guys. I told I checked my deck before. Sorry, guys. All righty. But by the way, those two cards did come out. Um, when I was doing the reading before. Those two. They did. So I guess that's why they're, they're turned over. All right. So let's go into this. What is she here to say? What, did, what is the comic here to say? Oh my God. We got five of cups. Cancer Pisces Scorpio Energy. We have four of swords. I'm taking four cards. Four of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. Okay, well, she has more to say. Of course, she can't obey. Um... She's got four of wands in reverse. Leo Sagittarius, Aries energy. 
She has Knight of Pentacles in reverse, Virgo energy, and she has Queen of Wands. What does she come to say? She says Queen of Fire. <clears throat> the F, at least she's respectful. Um, I don't know if you know, but it's it's over between myself and the DM. It, it's over. Good going. Good going. It's over. Okay? You, you did it, right? It's over. He's no longer putting in the effort in this connection. He's no longer making any offers in this connection. He's no longer being a provider. And my, I'm heartbroken. My heart is absolutely broken. I'm grieving. I'm grieving. And I just can't seem to get over it. I can't seem to get over the pain. I can't seem to heal. I can't seem to heal. I, I don't understand what's happening. I wish you could see DF's face right now. DF is not pleased. She is not pleased and she is not impressed. This is what you came here to tell me. That's what she's saying. What does DF have to respond? What does DF respond to that? She's not pleased. She's already frustrated. I don't expect a pretty answer. But anyway, she is DF, so she's composed. What does she have to say? Four cards, please, spirit. DF responds with Knight of Wands reversed. Can I say this is the first card that came out when I was doing it before, but it was upright. She's coming back with the same message. She's coming back with the same message. And she's also responding to the first assertions by the karmic that it was just lust between the DM and DF. She says Eight of Pentacles reverse. And we had Sorry, Eight of Pentacles upright, and we had Eight of Pentacles reverse. She has Eight of Wands upright. And she has Ace of Pentacles in reverse. She says, yes, I know. I know it's over. He didn't have to tell me. Spirit told me. I know it's over. I got that communication already. I'm the queen of fire. Spirit told me it's over. You didn't have to tell me. I know it's over. I know that everything is, has totally destabilized. I know. I know that he wants to put in the work in our connection. I know. I know that he does not want to be a player anymore. And he's coming in with a solid offer. I know. Spirit told me. Is that what you brought me here for? And the karmic says, she says, death card, Scorpio. She says, ace of cups reverse. Cancer Pisces, Scorpio energy. She's all in her feelings. She says, star car reverse. Damn. She says, three of swords. She said this again, I, I'm absolutely heartbroken over this three part, third party situation. I'm absolutely heartbroken. I feel like my heart will never heal. It's just broken into a million pieces. He's changed so much. He's gonna go on some kind of transformation. I don't even recognize who he is anymore. And he's certainly not offering any love to me. I can't believe that he just allowed the situation to die. I feel so hopeless and I'm absolutely heartbroken. DF is still wondering why she's telling her all this. Anyway, 
So they have response. Um, nine of cups. <laughs> Guys, I don't mean to swear or anything like that. But this DF, she's a bitch. I'm so <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. She's a classy lady, but she's a bitch. I don't normally say that. <laughs> DF is not pulling any punches today. <laughs> she is not. Oh my god. Oh my god if you see this message that's coming out here we have the nine of cups upright cancer pisces scorpio energy we have the five of pentacles in reverse taurus Virgo, capricorn energy we have the knight of swords my god knight of swords reverse gemini libra aquarius energy and we have justice mm -mm -mm. He says, well, I can't help it. I can't help it that I'm his total wish fulfillment. And I can't help it that he's left you out in the cold. I have no idea why you're even coming in to tell me anything like this. It's not my fault that you lied. It's not my fault that you won't be in your authentic self. And it's not my fault that you received your karma. To which the karmic response. eight of pentacles in reverse it comes out again eight of pentacles in reverse um taurus Virgo, capricorn energy four of cups in the upright cancer pisces scorpio energy queen of pentacles in reverse Capricorn energy. An ace of pentacles in the upright. She's coming back up with a message from before. She says, I, I don't know what happened. He just seemed to lose complete interest in our situation. He seemed to lose complete interest in me. And he just stopped making the effort. He stopped making the effort. I thought we had something stable. But he says all I'm interested in is his money. I thought that's why we came together. To build something strong in the material world. I don't understand what happened. Yeah, I, I like money. I know that. But I thought that was, you know, a common interest between both of us. And DF replies. Okay, guys, the headache is coming on. <clears throat> Hangman upright, Pisces energy. Six of cups, reverse. Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy. <laughs> Six of Wands reverse. Oh my God. Ace of Cups reverse. And the chariot in reverse. What is DF saying? DF says, instead of coming to me with your issues, what you should be doing is being in hangman mode. You need to gain a different perspective on this connection. You need to learn the lesson why this particular connection didn't work. 
you need to remove your ego because you can't win. And this is a divine connection. You can't win, okay? So what you need to do is figure out why you guys manifested such a toxic connection and such a codependent connection in the first place. You have to figure out why your relationship didn't work. Coming to me and telling me about it and telling me about the breakup is not going to help you. You have to learn the lesson. You need to be in hangman mode, not calling meetings. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Literally, DF just rests that on the comic. She, as we say in the Caribbean, she just rests it on the comic's chest. <laughs> And comic response. I'm not going to be able to do this for much longer, you know, guys. This um, headache is really, really getting to me now. Okay, I have to stop this now. <sighs> At least I can talk this time. <laughs> she has Queen of Cups. She said this in my first attempt. She said it in her first, in my first attempt. She has King of Swords. Cancer. Aquarius energy. Chariot in reverse. Cancer energy. And she had this again, temperance. Temperance. She says, I, I, can't, I still can't believe he cut me out of his life for you. I can't believe it. It's like he just stopped looking at our situation, stopped trying to figure out why our situation wasn't progressing and just started looking at you and then he just came and told me all this information about you and that how he loved you and that you were so balanced and so beautiful and so fiery and that you were his other half i just can't move on from that i can't move on from that i thought we had something stable together I thought we had something balanced. And he just came, he spoke his truth, told me about this love and that was it. It was done. And DF, I think the comic is just in disbelief. She's like, she's in shock. She's in shock. She keeps saying the same thing over and over again. It's, she can't believe, she can't believe, she can't believe this is happening. She's in shock. She's been shell-shocked. She has magician. That's Virgo and Gemini energy. She has nine of pentacles. She has the judgment reverse. And she has the tower. She's like, well, it wasn't all his doing. Spirit brought the tower down because it was unstable in the first place. And the tower made him realize who he was. He was a magician. And that he can manifest anything that he wanted. And that he wasn't codependent. That he could be single, he could be abundant, and he could strike out on his own. That he could love himself. That's what happened. It wasn't about my love. It wasn't about him loving me. It's about him loving himself. And I am him anyway. I'm the next half of his soul. He was unawakened before. He wasn't answering the call of destiny. But spirit brought the tower down. And that shifted everything. He wasn't seen clearly all the time. But spirit came. And now he saw everything. He saw who you were. He saw who he was. And he figured out why he was here. And that's why he had to leave. And karmic says. She 
she says seven of pentacles reverse she keeps saying the same message over and over again taurus Virgo, capricorn and i think she's she's numb she's in shock she's in shock she's saying the same things all over in it she's just saying the same things over and over again i think she needs counseling oh that's too much if they're to come out they'll come out again it's just too much cards you're saying too much comic you're saying too much she says king of wands reverse she says judgment in reverse And she says page of pentacles reverse she, she keeps rehashing what happened between her and the dm she says i i don't understand what happened I, i'm still not understanding what happened my judgment is not fully grasping what happened it's like one minute we were all right we were fine and then he just stopped investing in the connection he stopped being interested in sex and in me and he just stopped making any offers there was no gifts no kinds of no acts of kindness he just stopped giving to the connection and df who is getting very bored at this point in time because she's hearing the same thing over and over again We have six of swords reversed. We have knight of pentacles reversed. So six of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Knight of pentacles is a Virgo. Um, we have empress in reverse. And we have queen of wands upright. She says, well, the foundation between you guys was always shaky because it was never based on love. It, it might have been based initially on passion. Maybe it might have been based on the material world, but all this falls away. All this falls away. See, you guys weren't in your divine power. You're no, you're no empress. You're, you're no match for the empress. You are unhealed. Right now you need to be focusing on your healing. And focusing on, you know, being the best version of yourself. Focusing on manifesting your own abundance. Focusing on stepping into your power. Not dragging me into your drama. Um, guys, we're going to leave it here. Um, we're going to take a little break. Um, we're going to go over to Extended and see what it said there. But it looks like DF is getting bored of this thing. Because... Um, comic is only saying the same thing over and over again it's like she just can't believe she just can't believe she doesn't know what happened she, she's shocked she doesn't she just keeps saying the same thing over and over again let's see if she changes her tune um in the extended and actually says something okay all right guys if you enjoyed this video please click the like button and even if you didn't enjoy because comics was a little annoying today please click the like button <laughs> and make a comment down below okay um, it really helps the channel and please subscribe i put up videos every day all right guys take care bye